Hey, gang, we're back from Michele. It's a fun class, probably our favorite type one of this, your favorite class of all time. It's my favorite class of all time. Michele is the king, King Solomon, son of King David. Mazel class is pretty good, too, I got to admit. Mazel class is pretty good. But, but Michele is like a the brand name, you know. It's uh, Michele is the good stuff. But, yeah, they're all good. Okay, now we're read your meme up there. A wise man will hear, check that, we did it, and will increase learning, check that, we did that. A man of understanding, that's called Navon, whatever that is, will attain uh, Yikne, wise counsel, whatever that is, Tachbulis. And we want to know why is Tachbulis different than Musar Hasekel type one. And once we finish. The Hebrew will go into the Anglit. All right, so we're in the Yishma Hakima, the Yosef Mada. All right, now the last three words, Navon Tachbulus Yikne. We're in the Aramaic translation. Ready? Targum Yonason. Vesuchlosa, Vesuchlos, Mich. Now, I remember that from our earlier verses. That is like the brilliance of Joseph. Right? Remember that? Brilliant. Imagine you saw something or someone that was just utterly brilliant. Like glowingly brilliant. So Solomon giving wisdom from Zion, right? That's called... What is that called? Yikne is Yikne. That must be the Takbulus. So Takbulus is going to be that for further investigation. I might look that up. It might be a unique way of saying it. Midab, mid, ma, or this is Aramaic here. Madbaranusa, midbaranusa, midbaranusa. Oh, no, so Navo, oh, sorry, no. Suchlan, Suchlasa, man, tongue twister. Suchlasana is Navon, an understanding man. There you go. There you go. There you go. Uh, so an understanding man is a brilliant man. Now, I mean, remember, he who hears the matter in the matter. Our word, we want to know what it really is, Tachbulus in Hebrew. Mad Baranusa. Wow, what is that? Before we go in the Aramaic, let's look at the commentaries. You ready? Justin B, type one. John, type one. Ready to go. All right. Rashi, Navon, Moisif, Al Yadiyas Chochem, Shiodea Lavin, Devar, Matok, Devar, and Moisif Al Shmuaso. A, a Navon, a man of understanding, is additional in brackets praise than the Chacham. Okay? Let's imagine that there's the guy by the book, and he's awesome by the book. Type one. Guys by the book, but he's awesome. And then there's the Maverick who improvises and is even more awesomer. Type one. He's super de- duper de more awesomer. Got it? Why? The awesomer guy, yes, I'm aware of the poor grammar. He knows intuitively how to understand the matter in the matter, and he adds on what he hears. So he hears you, and he hears into you. You got that? He would say awesomer is an icker term, <laughs> or whatever it is. You understand? The, the man by the book says, poor grammar, I don't get it, I don't understand you, type one. All right, that's on the phone. That's on the phone. Okay, so that's Navon. 
Again, we're looking through. So we want Tachbulas Yikne, right? And who's talking about? It? Okay, so Mitsuda Sion. Tachbulas. Ready? Wise counsel, whatever that is. Iniano Dacus. Ha'in. Wow, Justin, Becker, John, that's good. It's, oh man, that is really good. Um, it's extracting the minutia of wisdom, but really minutia. That makes a radical difference. You understand? He, he's able to perceive... The, the complex matter, and by investigating his mind and powers of perception that are very subtle and fine, he gets it. Okay. Yikne, Matsena Loshin, Kenyan, Sudasiyam, Af im ein shomaycher. So he acquires even without sale, like Abraham and Shem. He acquires, like, metatronically, not, not from by the book sale. You got that? Like, if Pirkei says you acquire a friend, he's not paying for his friend. Raul Bag, Dvarim Lekoichim Medaku Makshava. Here, I'll tell you the exact word. Who wants to hear the exact word of Tichbulis? Everyone Google the word adroit. Justin, Google adroit. A-D is in dog. R-O-I-T is in Tom. He has an adroit mind. A crafty, nimble, uh, dex- dexterity of mind. He who has dexterity of mind will acquire clever or skillful in using the mind. See that? That's how you acquire without money. So the wise man hears and gets nuggets. You will get a million dollars if you invest in Coca-Cola. The wise man says, wow, this guy knows where it's at. Justin, did you get this? Bob Jones says if you invest a, a, a million dollars, blah, 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 Coca, blah, and he goes out and does it, what happened? He won a million dollars. He knows a nugget when he hears it. I heard they have great sandwiches at Bob's hoagie stand. You know what he did? He heard it. Because they put banana peppers on the sandwich. Oh, man, if you put banana peppers on, that means it is artisanship. He knows how to make a sandwich. And he goes and says, by God, it was a great sandwich. But the Navone, the Navone gets it without it ever actually being said literally. Like out in the open, obviously. He extracts it. Much like we talked about in the Mazel class last night. As if life is tangible and he can make like a due point of, of reality. Condensation. It just condensates for him. It spills over into him. And he uses his mind to cut the tension of reality. And he takes it. He, he takes from God. Okay. Okay. Now, let's see if we're caught up, and we are, although we got some mar- mall beam to do. Why is that? Okay, I see the mall beam's on the next page. I was wondering where the mall beam was. Let's do the mall beam, and then let's go to the Aramaic, and we're done for today.
It's a long moment. No, it's not that long. I lied. I lied. Yishma Chacham. Begar Yo'ilo El Hachachamim Venavonim. Shachacham Shagidro Misha Kabel Chleke Chachma Marabo Sav. The Chacham is a great student. He's got a teacher. He's got books. He knows how to learn. He gets stuff. He's he can he can extend the words of the sages, you know. He'll read the manual and understand how to put it together. Combines wisdom to create new wisdom. There you go. He he's just he's got it, man. He's he's a wise man. He is sharp. He's got books. He's got tools. He's got resources. He's got mentors. He's in the academy of wisdom. But why is the Navone better or more praiseworthy? The Navon, he's Mac- MacGyver. You guys remember MacGyver? He, he, uh, the Navon's above. I kind of figured that when I read it this now. But he is still, the wise man's kind of that too, the way you wrote it in English. That the wise man has endless wisdom accessible to him. But the Navon, right? Yeah, like you said, create new wisdom. He, uh, you know, to kind of bar, it's to keep with the word wisdom with the Chacham, the, the man of understanding, he can just like create new. He's entering a new world. It's Terminator 1 and Terminator 2. Uh, there we go. Which which parable do you like over there? For the Chacham or for the Navon? But that's going to be by uh, uh, Acquire Tachbulus. Yeah, right? Yeah, exactly. Tachbulus is also strands of rope. So, so the Navon, yeah, exactly. How do you identify the Navon? He acquires Tachbulus. It can be translated as Shegeder milas tachbulahi, shemotzi todas muschus, ayade hikshim rabim meshulash 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 lim zemze. He he creates offspring. It's uh, I'll tell you what it is. Justin, I want a table, okay? A really nice entertainment center, type one. So the Chacham goes and he reads about it and studies, and he doesn't ask me, he's perceptive. He comes, looks at my office. You need a, a model AA5C. And he puts it together, and I have a great table, type one. The Navone. Heard you say in passing, you need a table. He heard also that his neighbor, who's rich, is giving away a table brand new. And he suggested it brings it over. And it's missing a, a, another level for a lamp. And he's able to create the exact piece to make it perfect. You see what I'm saying? He's drawing from nothing. He's bringing wisdom out of what he heard, a conversation. He's got a connection. And he's able to produce Sha'ayadeh has safer has 
Yikne Hakdomis Rabbis. That the, the, the book of Mishle, which is like the beginning of all wisdom, he's not going to tell you how to put the table together. But he'll tell you every matter of wisdom. And he'll teach you how to understand it. It'll bring out many streams from the power of understanding one uh, from the, from his friend, literally Chavero, but like from this angle and that angle, and he'll bundle it together and expand the limits of his understanding. And that's a little, it's a bit rough. Justin, do you have the exact English for that? My English was all right, I think, right? Is it, is it, fair, is it comparable? Does that match up with what you got? Again, he brings out many strands from the power of understanding. One, like from that compilation, and from this compilation, he compiles an expanse with no limit of his understanding. Justin, one or two. Justin, one or two. All right. So again, the Navon is an explosion of wisdom from acute understanding. The wise man brings you lots of wisdom. Now for the big job. Aramaic, I want to see what this word. Takbulis is in Aramaic. That's the question. Mad ber man, tongue twister. Mad beranusa. Mad beranusa. Mad beranusa. Mad beranusa. You don't hear that every day, do you? Mad Bidarudva Mad 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 B Mad Barasa Mad Branusa. There it is. There it is. Strategy scheme. All right, Justin, we're done. Write this down. All right? Write it down. Strategy. The Tachbulot is strategy or command. And when I say command, I'm not saying, hey, Justin, turn left. We're saying that Justin had command over the AK-47. Justin, type one if you caught that. All right, so write down that for Tachbulot. Strategy, command, and make sure you get command right. Mastery, it's called mastery, command slash mastery, okay? And... We're going to start by looking up Tachbulot and the Navon Yikne. And Justin, we're going to compare Tachbulot in Hebrew and English to Musser Haskell. Musser Haskell from 1 3. We're in 1 5. I want to know why our English calls it. Wise counsel, and over there they called it wise counsel. So another way of saying that is, why is Tachbulot called wise counsel when we're calling it command or strategy, mastery? Thank you for listening.